Say hi to Puck. He wants to just sit here on my lap while I play the game. Okay, you can sit there. Fine then. Fine then. Okay. Where were we? We're on our way to fight a griffin. What's over here? Ah, my favorite pupil. What is it that you wish to learn? Here's the latest information I have. Study it well, Clive. Allow me to explain. Again. No. You already explained enough. A part of me thought Drake's head might be the last crystal we ever cracked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm glad I was wrong. Koopa. Did I hear you say you're hoping to hunt down a griffin, Koopo? Then I have to build it for you, Koopo. Especially a horrible one that calls Dozemare. Oi. Oh man, we have to. Oh, so we're gonna have to just start fighting these guys, man. Oh no. Okay, we'll do the... We'll do uh, uh, the butcher's thing first. Then we'll hunt those guys. Thank you for sticking with us. Those of us who are still here. Perhaps I'd live longer if I bade this town way. farewell. So. I've grown rather fond of the old place. That's good. Ah, welcome. Times may be hard, but if you got the gill, I got the goods. What can I do you for? Unwanted violets. If you have them. Though I'd gladly settle for learning what they are if you don't. <laughs> Boy, I haven't heard folk call them that since I was a lad. You're looking for scorpion tails. What? Unwanted violets is what folk used to call them back in the day. They turn a wicked purple when you boil them up. Hence the name. <laughs> used to chuck them in the pot when there weren't nothing else on offer. When there was a war on, that sort of thing. Thankfully, times aren't yet as hard as that. And even if they were, you wouldn't find anyone selling them these days. Do the scorpions still live nearby? I dare say they do. Three reeds would be your best bet. Memory serves. Thank you. You've been most helpful. Nice. So white. Stay sharp. After what the Empire did to Martha. Don't you go causing any trouble now. No promises. Ready, go. Let's go. I was hoping. I was hoping.
makes it so much faster. Way faster. Oh, the hideaway. Whoops. Oh, the low times, though, man. Insane. Did you find the uh, even... mystery ingredient? I did indeed. There you go. Marvelous. Let's see. <gasps> what am I supposed to do with this? It's poisonous, surely. You wouldn't be wrong. But that's your unwanted violet. <laughs> <laughs> Into the pot it goes, I suppose. Uh, wait here. I won't be long. You asked, and I shall bring it. The fudge. I present Chance's Stew, risen once again from the ashes of obscurity. Grab a spoon, Sid. Let's eat while it's hot. I'm uh, not hungry. Well, it'll be too late once I've licked the bowl clean. Your loss. <laughs> Salt on the senses is like choking <laughs> on swamp water. And and yet, up through the pungency there rise complex meaty notes. It it takes a moment to recover from such an onslaught of flavours, but never have I tasted anything so fine. Thank you, Sid. Ooh. Thank you. You're welcome. I share this gift. I won't rest until the steaming bowl of Chance's stew sits before everyone in the hideaway. <laughs> a single mouthful, and Molly will be breeding scorpions of her own. Ooh. I'm sure she will. Nice. Badge of metal. Ooh, increases defense by 30. Fuck yeah. It's actually pretty badass. <sighs> well, that was certainly not what I expected. I wonder what other surprises await me on my pilgrimage. We shall find out in the future.
Okay, so typical nobles. Let me find these uh little bastards over here. From Lost Wing to care one of our older. Sound you blast of wind. Hear cry, crushing locals. The beast must hate it. Care Norvent, West Gate. Norway West Gate. There's Glorious Gate. Where's West Gate? Let me get my phone. know where the hell this is
Norbent then. Okay. Head to the castle. This is no time to ride. Why not? Come on. Ready, go. Yeah. Need no stinking spider legs. <sighs> oh, these damn dirty bastards. I already beat y'all. I need to beat y'all again. Just make y'all look bad. for easy prey. Let's hope our craftsman hasn't bitten off more than he can chew. He deserve a rest. Uh oh. Get him. Ah! 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 
Motherfucker. friend something there boy the hell could that be our man Is there a box anywhere? Nope. Are you all right? Yeah. Dare say I'll survive. That griffin caught me before I could get an arrow off. Must have lost sight of me in the grass, though. I'd be dead if it hadn't. More likely than not. My name's Camille. I'm a lowly leather worker, if you couldn't tell by the smell of me. Not so lowly from what I hear. You remember selling to a merchant by the name of Karen? Uh, she's not an easy woman to forget. Bought a caress from me after I lost my buyer. Quite taken with my work, as far as I recall. Didn't stop her bartering me down to a pittance, though. <laughs> she sent you for a refund? It's not her who sent me. Well, consider me flattered. You should be. He's a master of his art. And not an easy man to impress. Blacksmiths are proud folk. It's a rare thing indeed for one to praise a glorified tanner. And I don't imagine an impressive swordsman like yourself would be getting your steel from any but the best. I'd oh, yeah. dearly love to help a fellow craftsman, but... Well, actually... I suppose you could give him this. What is it? Treated leather. Same stuff I used to make that caress. If your man's as skilled as he sounds, he'll know what he's looking at. You sure? Well, you did save my life. And thanks to you, I'll be going home with all the griffin hide I can carry. I'd say it's the least I can do. Short of showing him how to make the thing myself. That is. But there are rules against it. Secrets of the trade and whatnot. In that case, I'll see that he gets it. I'd be much obliged if you would. Right. I've got some griefs to make. You send your blacksmith my regards. Will do. And thank you. Hopefully this will sweeten Blackthorn's mood. Hell yeah. We're the best of all. No one's never gonna take us down. Cause we're the best. Run like the wind. Oh, nice. We've never been here. <clears throat> Let me 
look around real quick. There ain't no damn boxes. Those are gonna be. So now we got a, a obelisk to go to. Obelisk. Monsters taken quite a liking to Lady Cam. And with a bit of luck, Clyde might even find the geezer. Bloody busybodies, the both of you. Nah. <laughs> well, guess what? How'd it go, Clive? We found him. Did you find him, or does the hunt continue? I found him. And he asked me to give you this, along with his regards. joking nope I never joke about this said he wouldn't teach you how to work it but that if you were as skilled as you sounded you'd have no trouble understanding how it was done uh, so that's his secret crafty bastard he's layered and cross-grained it a few times too Wonder it's tough, and that's no ordinary oil he's used to get that finish. Oh, this is fine work, even finer than I thought. Yeah, I'll take your word for it. Just looks like leather to me. Still, oh, oh, oh. simple I'm glad guy. you're happy. Here, simple-minded people, I'd swear. You didn't happen to catch the fella's name, did you? Camille, I believe. I thought as much. There ain't many leather workers in the realm daft enough to do their own hunting, see? And his name kept cropping up when I was asking around. Turns out, he's from Tabor. And again, most leather workers are. But our friend Camille guards a long-held family secret, the details of which are the subject of some debate in the leather working community. Then we better keep this close to our chests. Listen, sorry for putting the both of you to all that trouble. Should have kept my moaning to myself. Still, I'm glad you found him. This has cheered me right up. That was the idea. Clive's idea, anyway. He did most of the work. Yeah. It's good to have you back, Blackthorn. Just don't expect me to go turning out work like this. There's a reason he does his own hunting. He knows exactly what eyes to look for. And that's how he gets them to layer up so nicely. <laughs> Don't get me started on how much oiling this leather would need. But I reckon I can make something about as good. Something a curse breaker will have no trouble caring for. Anyway, enough narrowing. I've got work to be getting on with. Looks like we won't be needing a new blacksmith. As if there was a better one out there. I nah, wouldn't have been the same anyway. No one spins a yarn like old Blackthorn in his cups. <laughs> right, now that's sorted. I've got duties to attend to. Thanks, Clive. You've given me my mate back. Nay. Hey. Drake Slayer's belt design draft. Ooh.
Yeah, I obtained a design draft for the Drake Slayer's belt. Design drafts unlock the new crafting options at the Black Hammer. Visit Blackthorn in the hideaway to details on material requirements. <clears throat> What'd you need? What'd you want? Electrum? How do I get that from? Look at... Damn! Anything else? Maybe I won't be able to get it. Thank you for sticking with us. Those of us who are still here have to look after each other. Now. It'll take ages to tidy all this stuff up. <sighs> oh, you know damn well I'm gonna get that sucker. All right, Sid. No use calling Ambrosia now. Why not? Let's go. Chocobos everywhere. Oh. Damn direction. Completely wrong direction.
to the stables, girl. If I can even go to it. We shall find out. But they want it. Time to ride. There we go. The Empire have dragoons. Do you know the words to the second verse of The Phoenix Sleeps in the Rose Bed? One of my clients can't go to sleep without me singing him old Rosarian lullabies. Only I've quite forgotten how it goes. Okay. Weird. Dude, I'm like the worst at doing anything. Oh, Sid. Ready, go. I'm like the worst person with directions in the universe.
It's like a mission or something. Just a mission. But we can go find uh Technical nobles. The other bounties. Reach their view. There we go. Oh yeah, we're gonna find it. Keep them pilgers nice and chilled. Look at this place. Let's go. Faster, faster. Is that it? Oh, that's got to be it. Hey, you sexy little. Oh. 
Oh yeah, baby. Oh ho! Straight up destroyed it. Wrecked the hell out of that damn bad boy. Rest well. I know I will. Good girl. Easy money. Easy money. Alright, what's the other one? Typical nobles. Whooping butt, taking names. Uh -huh. No use calling Ambrosia now. Oh, there's always a route. There you are. Good girl. Fly, Ambrosia. Right where I needed to be. I've been here before. But there wasn't nothing here. Uh huh. Here ye be. Thanks, girl. You son of a bitch. Die, you get your butt all whipped. Uh. Got him.
Ho Destroyed. Oh, there aren't any more of them. I want to pet on my little doggy. Sweet. Typical nobles. Yes, we got them all. We are so the badass. How may I help you today, Clive? Your benefactors are a generous lot. A rose is a rose orchestra row. Empty shard. The fuck? How did it go from 100 to 135? Used to be I would step into a tavern only to find myself overwhelmed with requests to sing of Dion the bold or Coral the servant girl but now all anyone wants to hear is Sid the outlaw you may have made me very rich man my friend Dude, what? Hmm. I'll just keep on collecting. Best of luck out there, Sid. A part of me thought Drake's head might be the last crystal we ever cracked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anything else to do in here? Nope. Kicked everyone's ass. Sea voyage this time, is it? I can lend you an oil skin if you're looking to keep the salt off your back. Sure. Sounds a good bit to me. It will be over soon. All right, I'm gonna jump in the restroom. I think so. I think so. Yeah. When you told me you had to come to terms with your past. You weren't talking about destroying Drake's breath, were you? No. I spoke of Imran, the leader of the Crystalline Orthodox, the man who made me do all those unspeakable things. I'm going to kill him. It's what I need to do to put the past behind me. What I need to move forward. And I know that I can do it. If you're there beside me. Always. And I'll be beside you, too. We'll bring down the Mother Crystal together. All while Sid looks on. We'll make him proud. On my way, hold on.
Oh Here be the monsters. Oh, it's already right around the corner. That's what I need to do. The boiling sea. Ooh, cool. Of course the audio is just non existent. Useful trick. Freezing and throwing the spray to make mist. How did you learn to use your powers like this? The masters made me do it. When the crusaders took to the seas. To keep the fleet's movements from prying eyes. <clears throat> I'm fine. No, you're not. What the fudge? Oh no, the curse. This may be the only chance I get to go back. Oh, you gotta be My kidding me. My only chance to put things right. I have to do this. Whatever the cost. All right. She's gonna fucking turn into stone, ain't she? Oh man, no! There she is. The Iron Kingdom's Mother Crystal. Ooh. Drake's breath. Nice. <laughs> That's a wicked looking place. What's up, Matthew? Strong currents, sharp rocks, and ether floods. Let's not forget them. We're on the monsters Silent hunt is a chapter. Fortress. But safety breeds complacency. Allowing a single rowing boat to slip in unseen. The sanctuary Ooh. is inside the mountain. If we follow that the place old trail, we should be able to enter by the back gate. How's it going, right. bud? Let's go. Fire and ice. I always imagined when I came here it would be to reclaim it. It used to belong to Rosaria, didn't it? Once, though Dude, it's been in the Iron Blood's clutches for far too long. As was I. For 13 years, this rock was my home. I know its secrets only too well. Holy this crap. This path was abandoned after an ether flood. They don't guard it anymore. The perfect little shortcut. <laughs> Ooh. 
Dude, this base looks fucking sick. Yeah, I'm sure you already beat this game. <laughs> Freaking sick! Oh yeah, nice. Was that an earthquake? They happen all the time. That wasn't even a bad one. It's nothing to worry about. Get your ball. into the caves from there. I wasn't passing up any potions. Ugh, look at this place. What a mess. Wait. Just like old times. You sure to keep clear of this 
Almost, almost, almost. Yes. Listen here. We're inside the volcano. You get used to the heat. Though I don't remember it being quite this hot. Oi. That's not good. Oh, yeah. Sickle. 
Damn dirty scorpions! Shall I kill you all? I feel like I should go up. Stop using your powers, girl. How are you going to get back?
not going this way. Let's look for another path. This place reeks of danger. Mother beans. I tear it thy ass up. Mithril whistle? These bastards. They never leave the lava. If I didn't know better, I think this volcano was about to erupt. Why attack us? They're peaceful creatures. Then this one must be the exception. <laughs> Thank you. 
Quite a commotion our friend made. Let's hope the guards didn't hear it. The gate to the inner chambers is just up there. Then we make for the sanctuary. I need to finish this. Before the heat finishes me. Here, here. Yeah. Uh -oh. We'll enter the Comric by the Handmaiden's living quarters. It was always a hive of activity. Sounds like we'll have a hard time staying out of sight. We won't have to. There's someone there I should very much like to see. Hey. These it don't take a hundred years to go up ladders. Stairs of Doom. Got to be cautious. Ye winches. Ah, Lady Marley, it's me, by some buffer. Jill, it can't be. It is, my lady. I cannot talk here. Come with me. Who's gonna snitch? That's all I'm waiting for, someone to snitch. I'm so glad you're safe. And I, you. Why ever would you risk coming back? Are you a fool, girl? Or have you grown tired of your freedom already? <laughs> Forgive me, my lady, but I had to come back. There are things I left undone. Tell me, where is the Patriarch? The Patriarch. At this hour he'll be in the Comric, giving thanks. You mean... Oh, Fiend! Clive, we have to get to the sanctuary. Now. Let's do it. Lady Marley, you must flee this place, gather your things, and go. <clears throat> now listen here, Jill. In Alak, Lord. We have company. <gasps> That will definitely hold him back. This way. Follow this passage. It leads straight to the Comric. Go on, stop dawdling. Thank you. You were always so kind to me. My light in the darkness. Take care, my lady, please. You deserve better than this. A long and happy life, promise me. She says nothing. I'll live. 
If you promise to do the same. She's dead as soon as she opens them doors. Come on, Clive. We're nearly at the Comrade. All right. Uh-oh. Destroy all you weak little bastards. Oh, she just sits there and watches. What is over here? This is crazy. How many of them are there? Too many. like the I'm running like how you used to run in uh, 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 Gears of War <laughs> super slow box give me the box oh 1200 gil sweet Clive there's something I need you to know I saw the patriarch do things no one should have to see 
and so I swore that he would die by my hand. I understand. I faced my demons, and you must face yours. Oh, yeah. Got to do what we got to do. Was it? That's all you got. The what? Oh, Ben! Holy shit. What's gonna happen? Shiva's dominant. Come yeah, to beg me. forgiveness for your failure. For years I followed your orders. Fought your wars. All to protect the children you took. Just as you took me. And what did you do in return? were sullied with a stain of ether. I merely cleansed them of their corruption. A penance Damn. made just as the Holy Mother wills it. Throws my sword right through his back. Repent, abomination. For a monster like you to set foot in the Holy Cymric is in itself a crime deserving of death. You're right. I am a monster, and my soul is stained black, though no, not by ether, but by the evil of men like you, who made me close my heart and drown in darkness when I should have raged against it. This is my penance. 
I will be your monster no more. Nor will I suffer you to create another. <laughs> Does the beast bare its teeth at its master? Come then, dominant. Rage, be as you have ever been. A monster! And what are you, Imran? I was forced to kill. You do it by choice! But never again. I bowed to you once. Now it is you who shall bow to me! Kill them. Now, right. What the fuck? Where the hell did he come from? Damn, Joshua. What? what the hell is that? Oh, whoa! Fire and ice. Bust out your badass. Okay. Dumbass. 
That's not good. My doggy's gonna get the burnt uh, diamond dust. Ooh. Go. All right. I won't take long. Well, don't talk about it. Whoa! Liquid flame extinguished. Without even being effort. this Clive <coughs> what the hell is happening to him Shatter thy crystal. <laughs> Hell yeah. Be gone, vile creature. Uh, crystal. That's for you and your One step mother. Freedom. Work to your mother. The crystal. What did you do to it? Oh. We destroyed it. What? What? Monster. Monster. Do you have any idea what you have done? I do, father. I have killed the monster and become an outlaw. 
May the blessing of the crystals go with you. <laughs> it's over. It is. And Shiva exacted her price. She did. Again, the burden fell to you. And I bore it willingly. This was a sin for which I had to atone. Now I can continue at your side with my head held high. The hell is he growling at? It seems like something's about to happen. Oh shit. Clive, look. It's a secret passage. It's just like the one at Phoenix Gate. Oh shit. Damn it. We need to leave. Agreed. No. Ultimus took on over Joshua. Bye, little dragon's breath. I kept my promise, and now you keep yours. Drake's breath. Ooh. Legacy, what's that? Turn the corner. The hell? Hold on. If Joshua's there, then who the hell was the other guy? This way, Your Grace. Oh man. You're bleeding. I have a tonic which will... Uh, I thank you for your kindness. Truly. But I assure you, I will survive. Please, save your medicines for those who need them most. <laughs> oh, well, if you're sure. What I have is incurable. For a moment there. I felt my brother's presence. You did. I fear he is in Ultima's oh my God. thoughts again. But why now, after five years of silence? I cannot keep him sealed away much longer. Your grace. Do not dirty your hands. Look at them all. Ultimus like gonna river, rip out of his chest like an sea. alien. Or moths to a flame, perhaps. The crystalline dominion, their light in the darkness. More and more lose their homes to the blight. And set out in search of sanctuary, while others lose their fortunes to the Dalmechian levies and leave to find new livelihoods. What is it that you seek in the Dominion, Your Grace? Oh, Virgil Lesage. You mean the Crown Prince of Sanbrek? 
He has many titles. Dion the Bold, Prince of Dragoons, Odin's Nemesis, or simply Bahamut. I met him once when we were children. He was a chivalrous soul even then, and has served his empire indefatigably ever since. And you are confident that he will listen to what you have to say? Our world lurches <clears throat> ever closer to the abyss, and a hidden hand ushers us onward. Ultima's influence extends to every nation, Sandbrek included. If His Highness is the man I believe him to be, and I pray that he is, this truth will not have escaped his notice. Yui. As the Mother Crystals fall, the eternal flame wavers and the azure sky begins to bruise. How lucky we were to be blessed by the crystals. And yet how spoiled. Like canaries in a gilded cage, growing fat on seed. <laughs> but now, the bars are closing in and we must take flight. Painful though it be to leave our home behind, it is what we must do to be free. Is it that men cannot live without? A blessing that leads to damnation, or a freedom that leads to deprivation? I do not yet know the answer to that question. Do you, Clive? <coughs> Your Grace, let us find a place to rest a while. We can return by the Dalmechian Trail once you have recovered your strength. I realize your duty is pressing, but if your health should fail... I know. Thank you, Yota. To breach the Empire's defenses, wonder how it's gonna happen whenever Ultima comes again. down. Only because your fleet has proved Will it as kill him? As a unit it looks like he's killing him. Would you rather we simply fell back to the capital? Enough, both of you. Hold here a like, we're gonna. There's a lot of bad things are gonna happen near the end. However, our casualties melt with each passing day. Sorry. There is a literal sea twixt you and your prize. The armies of Sambrek need but sit back and watch as you harmlessly lap against their walls. They are dug in like ticks and seek to draw out this siege, knowing the capital's stores are nigh bottomless. And what of our wise rulers? Goaded into war without any thought as to what chaos it might reap. Republican soldiers starve while waiting for orders from Randalar. If you would but take the field, their bellies would be full by nightfall. If I take the field, so too will Bahamut. And our duel will shake the island to its foundations. Instead of liberating the Dominion, you would doom it to destruction. Unless that is what you desire. Uh, uh, 
If our learned advisor yeah, has yeah. a solution to propose, we should be glad to consider it. Scary people. <sighs> Is that the Empress? Annabella. What is the meaning of this, Lord Kupka? What it means is that I am disinclined to advise you any longer. What? Ah, the looks on their faces when you walked through those doors. A perfect picture of stupefaction. They could not believe their eyes. Though I confess, I had my own doubts whether or not you would accept my invitation. Such shocking news. Sid isn't a son of a whore. He's the son of an empress. Your own dear Clive. Absurd. Who fed you these lies? I have never spent a moment among criminals, save at the gallows. I came here with my son. Not to entertain your baseless accusations, but to put an end to the senseless hostilities between our nations. Very well. You need only agree to the terms I set out. Sid took the life of someone dear to me. A woman by the name of Benedicta. I swore to take his in turn. This would not be disagreeable to you, I take it. You would finally be rid of the stain on your noble name. In return, I will leave Sandbreck in your capable hands. Your Imperial Majesty. Hmm. And all for the love of a common whore. <laughs> Dominant or no, one cannot hide one's breeding. And beasts will ever belong with beasts. <laughs> there are greater things in store for you, my darling Olivier. Soon enough, you shall be the crown prince of Sambrec. Oh, man. And when your father goes to meet great Grieger, you shall be emperor of all you survey. The old order shall come tumbling father? down, and you will rebuild the world in your glorious image. <laughs> Soon. Who is the father? What the hell is going on here? Holy crap. <clears throat> Find out Sid. She's been in there for hours. The old Sid. Something must be wrong. This is the father. It's okay, Clive. She's just taking a dump. After the storm. definitely end it right there guys that was a hell of a journey through hell and back when we go back when we come back we will go get that electrum and the other ingredients to upgrade our 
Ugh. Our items, our uh, outfits. Oh yeah, our armory. Hell yeah. It's awesome. Till next time, buds. I'll be back. Hell yeah.